What is up, man? 25 Gamers. In this week's episode of Beginner Tips, we're going to show you how to play run defense uh, out of any formation in Madden NFL 25. And we're going to show you today from the um, the sub uh, or the quarter 137, uh, predominantly a pass heavy formation. We're going to show you how you could initially uh, instantly turn it into run defense for anything that you face. We're going to be using a strong close halfback zone week, one of the better runs in the game here today to show you. Basically, uh, we have the dive, we have the zone week, and we're just going to show you out of this. But what we like to do is, out of any formation, it doesn't matter which one, you just want to show blitz. And you see when you show blitz, it's going to create a bear look. And when you get a bear look, guys, that is going to put more guys in the box. Now you see we have, in this, in this example, we have 10 guys stacking the box. What we like to do is we like to use or control Carter, and basically... Wherever the run goes, we're just going to fill the lane. So here he goes to the outside. Now, obviously, if you're in a quarter formation, that does make it a little easier for them to just run through you. But again, it's just the idea of can you make a run defense out of any formation. And actually, you can. Um, you don't want to uh, run commit. You just want to, but you definitely don't want to pass commit either. And you see with the quarter and the bear formation, you can just run through. Now, obviously, you want to get better tackling guys in there. So we'll show you now an example of the same concept, but from any other formation. So we'll show you here out of a 3-4 odd formation the same exact thing and we're going to use and instead of the strong close this time we'll just use the counter weak out of the strong pro just a standard running play. We see when we show blitz again again you make that bear look and so now you're going to use your control Carter in the center and basically wherever the run goes you're just going to fill the edge and, and again you're, you're using your big frame over the top. Now one thing I like to do uh, if they're good at running ball is I'll zone my linebackers in hook zones. For some reason hook zones do a very good job of playing the run. They just kind of sit on it. So here again hook zone, counter weak, we set the edge with Carter and now we have the run stopped in the backfield. That's how you play universal run defense from any formation. Now if you want to have universal quarterback sneak defense we'll show you that as well. You use the same concept that we've just discussed in this video. So in a situation where you want to have universal quarterback sneak defense, well, if we want to come out in the 146, it doesn't matter. What we're going to do is we're going to show blitz. We're going to, um, in this situation, we're going to run commit. And then we're just going to put Carter in the A-gap here. Run commit and basically just try to come through. And you see the quarterback sneak is borderline stopped here. Now again, depending on what formation you're in, is going to depend on how, you know, obviously, you want to just stack the box here. So in this situation, we're going to come from the left here. Run committing straight down. And you see now, and that was just kind of a fluke thing. But you see the idea here, and you could do this out of anything if they try to quick snap you. Obviously, it's done best from a 4-3 or a 4-4 or a 3-4. But it can be done out of other formations. And that's kind of the purpose of today's video, to show you you can stop uh, some of the better running attacks. So here, Power O, one of the better runs that a lot of people are using this year from the split offset. Show Blitz, look, this is the 155 Psycho. You see again, we're just going to shoot the A-gap because that's where the run was at. We're user controlling that A-gap. And you see how this concept applies to any formation, guys. And again, if you want to really play good run defense, don't have deep blues on the field. When you have deep blues on the field, they, they automatically will drop. But when they're yellows, they don't drop. And you can use a technique we like to use, which is put them in yellow zones and then disguise use the disguise cushion technique. And we like to back off our corners when we're using this. And so in this situation, if they try to bomb us deep because we've been stopping their run, you're, you're going to see that these... Um, these yellow zones, and I, I effed up there, I put the stupid idiot on an out route instead of a freaking streak, but, so here, I don't know what I'm doing, messing up all over the place, adjustments are horrible right now, but here we got a streak, that hook zone is going to follow him because we use that disguise cushion technique, and you see, even if we want to dive deep, we can no longer do that. And you see Harris comes up with a huge interception. So that is how we like to play universal run defense from any formation in the game. Hopefully this helps you guys out a lot. Uh, as a beginner player, you need some of this easy-to-learn stuff. And I think that the, the show blitz look will help you in any way, shape, or form when you're trying to stop the run in Madden 25. Thank you for watching this week. Be sure to tune in next week for another great episode of Beginner Tips. Thank you so much.